Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the extended attributes or inconsistent error you're experiencing on Windows 10. So some users are reporting that this issue would start when you open up a third-party application. This could basically come up really anytime you're trying to launch a program with administrative privileges. So this should hopefully be appreciated for the tutorial, and without further ado, let's jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu and you want to type in run and best match should say run right with desktop app or one of the best ones you want to select that and now you want to type in mmsys.cpl and then you want to hit enter. So now you want to navigate over in left click on the sounds tab. Now you want to go down until you find the Windows user account control sound. So scroll down here, right here. And once you've located that, you want to go set that to none. So underneath sound right here, click this drop down box, select none instead and then click on apply and OK. And once you've done that, I believe that should resolve most of your problems. If you have any recently installed programs, I would also suggest trying to remove them and see if maybe that was a direct cause of it. And another thing you can try would be to open up the start menu, type in CMD, and then command prompt should be one of the best results. Right click on it, and then left click on run as administrator. When you receive a user account control window, you want to left click on yes. And now that we're in this elevated command line window, you want to type in SFC space forward slash scan now, all one word, so SFC space forward slash scan now. Then you want to hit enter. This will begin running the system file checker utility and this will take some time to run, so just be patient. And that is just another consideration to be given. So I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.